it only takes an Allen wrench and Your a Your Honor, I doubt seriously that any of the deceased had been trained to the point to even know what sort of lasers they were dealing with. That's not true! If they had, they would be alive today in our estimation. What happens out there will not be in your law books. Isn't it true that you were the laser safety officer for the unit until being promoted to sergeant? Yes, ma'am, that is true. In fact, didn't Sergeant Mosby assign you to train your replacement as he rotated out of your unit? Yes, ma'am, he did. So it would be safe to say that whatever laser training your men had was a direct result of your training. Whatever training they may have had after my initial training should be up for, for the question. For the record, Your Honor, when Sergeant Podansky was still a corporal, he was issued a summary Article 15 for misconduct. He and a private Washington were caught playing Star Wars two years ago while on a training mission. So noted. This establishes a trend, if not a habit, of abusing the power and the danger of the lasers we issue our soldiers. At the time, we didn't know. At the time, you were instructed by Sergeant Mosby to attend extra training to learn the NOHD of Army-issued lasers, to properly operate and safely handle each of the lasers given to your unit, and to always be in control of where your laser points. Isn't that so? We can't hear you, Sergeant Podansky. Where are my laser points? Speak up, Sergeant. Where are my laser points? Say the words we need to hear. Where are my laser points? Where are my laser points? 